A colorful display of cigarettes and alcohol bottles line the shop wall, inviting you closer. The bottles wink at you in the light. The smokes, too, glitter in their wrapping. It's like looking into a kind of heaven. Your knees are weak. There, in that dark green glass, all in vain. The great flowing river of warmth, wine, alcohol, beer, alcohol, love, alcohol. Um, sure. If you want something, I can get it for you. Just let me know and pay and stuff. But I'm obliged to inform you that both alcohol and cigarettes damage your health. But I guess you already know that. Don't ask. Don't look. Don't do anything here. Just go away. Get back to work. Here you go, mister. 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 No, Frick only sells legal drugs, like the law says. There it is, a brave little army in your pocket. The first smokes platoon. Twenty brave souls standing in salute, ready to step into fire for you, sir. You picked the best one. This soldier is fat and succulent. What are you waiting for? Light up. Re-become yourself. Get a load of this rock and roll cop hair, people. Johnny Thundercop fishes a cheap lighter out of his pants. With a flick of the thumb, there's fire. A primal satisfaction. Here we go. The lighter's dark green disposable plastic. Safety's off. In your case, the safety is always off. Hey, you can't smoke in here. Please, don't fuck with Frit. Shut up. It's already happening. Repercussions. There's a high risk of glory, with a mild chance cool genius. Smoking makes you into an intellectual. Everybody knows that. It will help you concentrate a bit. That much is true. It only lets you concentrate because you're in nicotine withdrawal. It only mitigates its own. Blah, blah, blah. Boring. Light it up. Thick, warm smoke gets sucked down into your lungs. Immediately, you feel a warm nostalgia fill your head, body, and soul. A nostalgia for yourself. The man you were in your youth. Johnny Thundercop is back, and he's chill as balls. Well, Hello. Someone seems to have found himself a bottle of alcohol. Here's where the magic happens. Light reflects off the green glass of the Commodore Red. The gods have been generous. Better pop it open before they change their minds. Wow, the gods of mass production have made this alcohol container laughably easy to open. A child could have done it. I don't know about this. There's a satisfying pop as the cork jumps out, and the hair on your back rises like an army at attention. You've been here before. Welcome back, detective. You're home now. You see a flash of teeth, a young woman smiling at you, near some railway overpass in your ruined past. She is gorgeous, and she is yours. Nothing. Some mental stuff. Nothing to be worried about. Physically, you'll be strong as an ox. A golden sun melts down your throat. Its rays filling your nostrils with sunshine. Your stomach melts from it into a happy, gooey mess. So does your mind. All the bad things are melting. 
you're you again. A real cop. A real detective. Incredibly well done. From the void we came, and to the void we must return.